snowy Athens. Who'd have thought it'd be snowing here in Athens? It's crazy. But uh, the bus ride wasn't too bad actually. 5am start but um, we got here, oh not too late. Uh, I think the coach got here about 7 just before 7 so a long ride but it wasn't too bad. The views were nice and we stocked up with snacks and stuff. But yeah just in my hostel I've got the cutest little balcony and I'm gonna go explore tonight and see if I can find something for dinner. So I made it to this really nice little viewpoint. Look at that. Okay, focus. And then there's also the church of Marina at the Cielo, which is really cool as well. So it's a bit snowy and icy out in Athens tonight. Um, but I made it. I'm gonna go find the shop now. Oh no, I'm gonna end up slipping down here. <laughs> How am I gonna do this? So it's the first night here, I thought I'd take a walk just finding out a few facts. So um, it's one of the most famous ancient archaeological sites in the world apparently and over centuries it was used for many different things so like homes to kings and then a mystical home of the gods and then now like a tourist attraction but um, definitely be back here in the daytime. <laughs> and also <laughs> there's this funny little snow dog would you say? <laughs> Might have to turn the flash on. It's, funny. it's got sunnies and stuff. <laughs> oh, and a cucumber for a nose. <laughs> nice creative. Look how snowy it is. Looks like they've had to plough the roads and then dump it all here. Good morning, Athens! Look at all these orange trees. So it's still a bit snowy today. And um, basically some people I met yesterday at the hostel, um, they've been in Athens a few days and they were explaining what happened when it started snowing really heavily yesterday. So um, because it doesn't snow often, basically everybody that was living here or staying here at the time, I think they all got like a, a text saying, um, like an emergency text saying um, try and restrict all movement from now on because of the snow but um, yeah I think it's just because it wasn't it's never been maybe that heavy here um, and apparently everything was shutting down there's no roads working no ferries working to the islands <laughs> so everything was shutting down and the city was basically on a lockdown so I arrived yesterday after after all this was going on and then everyone in the hostel had kind of been in all day they kind of in like a lockdown which is so funny, like, <laughs> um, so yeah, that's how the city dealt with all the snow, but today it seems to be warming up slightly, not exactly warm, but there's still bits of snow on the road, um, but yeah, just really funny, I came on that same day, but kind of missed all the chaos and stuff, but hopefully everything will be up and running today, um, and I'm just going to have a few days exploring in Athens.
and Elise have come to this restaurant. It didn't say on the outside that it had vegan options, but as soon as you open this menu, look at all this. Voila! <laughs> they definitely have all it. these little vegan <laughs> signs. So that's what um, we like to see. <laughs> yeah, really good. So I'll see what I'm gonna go for, and then I'll take a video. What did they say on the menu? <laughs> did they say fries? I don't know. I didn't see it <laughs> after this whole discussion. But they're like soft chips in a way. Uh -huh. <laughs> They're soft, soft crisp, crisp. even. <laughs> so funny. But they're nice, they've got oregano. Yeah. <laughs> I, like them. I might have to get some ketchup uh -huh. to dip them in. Uh -huh. <laughs> Do you think they have it? So we got these Greek um, like wraps called a Slovaki or Slovaki or something. I got a mushroom one. And um, with our chips, yeah. Yummy. We'll give this a try. It's very traditional. Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Ren. Thank you. Thank you. Semolina halva. Semolina halva. So they gave us some little free cakes in our meal. This one's semolina halva. Yeah, so like, <laughs> I don't know, I'm very American. <laughs> a Greek uh, traditional thing, and then this one was like an orange pie. Orange pie. Mm -hmm. And he good. says they're very, very traditional. Oh, because. <laughs> so this one's vegan, apparently. It's just uh -huh. sugar and olive oil. Uh -huh. That's all he said. Yeah, and then this one's more like a cake. So. Which I. There's probably. I'll give it a go. Something more. But this one almost tasted like it had alcohol in it. I was mm. I was a little confused, but maybe not. Mm. That's an interesting texture. Yeah. Sugar and olive oil. Probably like, something else. Yeah, my friend really didn't like, like flour. That. <laughs> this one's a bit better because it's like orange. Mm. But yeah, but nice little gestures. It tastes I mean, like it has alcohol in it. Oh. <laughs> I'm a little confused. Once again, something else is closed due to the heavy snow. <laughs> to a national park and um what was it yesterday the storm yes so basically or the day, maybe the day before oh, okay but look at all these trees i think these have actually all fallen from the trees because <laughs> of the storm but yeah what was the text that you got the can text you show said, us uh, <laughs> severe severe weather warning avoid any unnecessary movement yeah so basically greece said nobody move it's snowing <laughs> I got the text, there was just like a few snowflakes falling from the sky. Yeah. So it was so strange. And it, it didn't snow that much, but now that we're walking around, we're seeing all of this destruction. Yeah. And these trees on the ground, and it's a little bit confusing. So it must have been bad. Like, there must yeah. have been winds in the night, maybe. Maybe. And then maybe heavy snow all through yeah. the night to like layer it up like this. Yeah. But yeah, it's really interesting. A load of the tourist attractions today are closed that we wanted yeah. to visit. Everything is closed mm. that we were wanting to go to, like the Acropolis, the museums, and all these places, but doing what we can. <laughs> yeah, but look at this. Uh -huh. This definitely looks like it's just snapped. Yeah, it's so but that is, like, that's full on. It must have been a storm, like a really bad yeah. storm. It's weird. Look at all this, it's falling on the ground. It's crazy. Just outside of the Temple of Zeus, which is just over there, which we had a look at just now. Some of it's in scaffolding, so you can't really see it all properly, but some of it's in the sun now, you can just see it. The Temple of Zeus. 
come to the top of the Acropolis for sunset and it's bloody gorgeous here. Imagine that with snow trampled on by people turned into ice overnight. The whole city is like an ice rink. <laughs> the amount of people. Yeah. Like coming down these steps, it takes us about 10 minutes to get down like two flights of stairs. <laughs> yeah. But like the amount of people we've seen almost slip over and then I have as well. <laughs> it's just funny. But it could be really dangerous. <laughs> These people are different. <laughs> Day three in Athens and the snow hasn't fully gone yet. But everywhere you go in the city, like the snow is melting off the rooftop, rooftops and it's like dripping off, off the little shelter bits on restaurants and cafes and stuff. But I think they're still like plowing the snow everywhere. Look at this road. And I'm going to check out the viewpoint again in the daytime. I went last night at sunset, which is also nice, but I also want to see it again in the snow, because why not? This is probably a rare occasion that you'd see Athens in the snow. But yeah, it's been really fun so far. Oh my god, look what I've just seen. <laughs> look at all these cats. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eight, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen cats. <laughs> Must be breeding time here. Look at all these puppy cats. Oh, and a lovely view. This viewpoint is just amazing. I'm here at the viewpoint, but I just honestly love it here. It's like 360 view of the whole city. You got the Acropolis over there, churches in the distance. Like it's just amazing from here. And with the white snow contrasting with all the white buildings, it's just oh amazing. I could sit here all day. But um, we were just wandering around uh, some little shops and flea markets uh, with some friends. I'm in the hostel, and I got a few new little rings. This little um, olive leaf looking one and then another little purple one to match my other purple one. But yeah, nice little souvenirs from Greece. But it's so pretty, I just can't get over it. Greek bakery and it's got they've got baklavas and everything and I just out of interest I just asked what they had that was vegan so they're getting me one of these biscuits ginger biscuits I think they're quite Greek and these are also Greek oh my god look at these birds <laughs> No, so I can put two or three. It's just plain Can you put two? Yeah, two. Okay. There's also a few vegan savory options, and there's this is a potato twist, and then like a spinach pie as well. So these will be nice. Oh! They're begging. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
at the top of a hill and look at these trees I feel like this is from the storm the other day like they've fallen being pulled out the ground and we're going to like a better's hill and we should be able to see the acropolis from here that's really nice and it's sunset on the last night our last day in Athens we'll go to the cat sanctuary tomorrow This must all have been melted snow. These views are just amazing. You can even see the sea over there. This is a lovely cat. This cuddles. Oh my god, these views. Not that view. <laughs> Just see the top. 